pull the light there and leave it open on that gear. There's Kathy's point made. Gone. Gone. Okay. Michael Lee. Chairman, Commissioners, I thank you for the opportunity to speak. My name is Michael Lee. I'm at 3286 Southeast 129th Street here in Stark, Florida. I'm a five plus generation Bradford County resident. I'm proud to say that my great grandfather, Pitcher, was out there in that hall. He was a commissioner. It ain't been three minutes. My great grandfather's picture out there in that hall from 1934 to 1939. Um, he served on this commission along with several of my uncles and cousins um, and was proud to do so. My sister lives on a farm that's been in the family for over in excess of 150 years. So we've been around Bradford County for a long, long time. I'm also a second generation <coughs> Florida plant retiree. My dad started work out there at the Florida plant in 1955. He worked from 1990 at 35 years of service. I recently retired in 2015. Together, he and I uh, was at that site out there for 60 of the 70 years that the site currently is celebrating. I would like to say that the Florida plant has successfully sustained operations since 1948, as you know, and has celebrated its 70th anniversary recently. So I attribute the success of that length of time to is due to the core values which it adheres to in all of its decisions. Those core values are safety and health, <coughs> environmental stewardship, highest ethical behaviors, and respect for people. The corporate values that I just stated, I was able to observe in my last job out there as an operations manager in some of the, the um, management reviews that we had. The management from the corporation would come down and take a look at what we were doing and all the decisions about the past and the present fell underneath those, those core values. I'd like to give you some examples of some of the things we were able to accomplish during my tenure out there and some of the things that I was proud of. During my career, I was part of a team that successfully implemented the capital project out there which dramatically reduced the amount of groundwater usage in the whole operation. That was over a million dollar project. And it was done not because the state mandated us to do that or some other regulation. We did that. Those ideas came from the Florida plant employees because it was the right thing to do. <coughs> Another example that I was proud of was when uh, a team of local decision, I mean, local citizens helped develop a, a local uh, employees helped develop an after-school facility in Lawdy where elementary school kids, so I'm, I apologize. So as you've heard from many of the employees here today, uh, a lot of them are little league coaches, Relay for Life organizers, church members, deacons, preachers. So in closing, I'd like to request that you pass the request for permit application based on the 70 years of history and the quality of the employees that represent this county. Thank you. 